What's up, y'all? This is your boy Jack, back again with another video. Today I'm going to be doing a review on the Apple AirPods first generation. Just like my other reviews, I'm going to go over the stats and then I'm going to give you my personal opinion and then I'm going to get you guys up out of here. So without further ado, let's get started. Uh, first things first, no noise cancellation with these. Uh, that's a feature that they probably missed out on because they don't they're not super secure inside your ear So a lot of noise kind of gets in there a lot of wind noise and things like that So just be wary of that talk time is uh, three hours Music playback is about five hours the overall standby time is about 19 hours with the case 24 hours for the second gen charges in about an hour via lightning cable no wireless charging on the first generation but the second generation has wireless charging has a 20 minute quick charge feature that'll give you about two and a half hours of playback which is clutch there's no official waterproof rating but i know people have worked out with them and you know lifted weights and ran and things like that so <clears throat> just there's no official rating uh they have dual beam forming microphones motion and speech detecting accelerometers to improve the mic quality and the music playback is i'm just going to be honest with you it's tinny and for the price i mean unless you can find these for like a hundred bucks uh I, I i can't recommend them uh me personally i would you know either pay about 20 or 30 dollars and get the samsung galaxy buds plus because the app does work on ios or I would just save my money if you want to stay in that Apple ecosystem. I would just save up for the uh, the AirPods Pro. Uh, that's just my opinion. I mean, they have Bluetooth 5.0. You can control the volume, track skips. Phone calls are amazing. So if you if phone calls is your thing, and you just want a a decent pair of uh, earphones within that Apple ecosystem, you will not go wrong. Uh, I would probably only recommend these for like YouTube, Netflix, maybe some podcasts and things like that. But it definitely has all your Apple ecosystem uh, things that go along with it. It has the W1 chip in the first generation and the H1 chip in the second generation. It read text, has Siri, uh, magnetic charging case, auto pause and play. Uh, it has pretty much all the features that you would want, you know, with a nice pair of buds. I just think, me personally, I just think that they're overpriced. Uh, I would definitely wait for a deep, deep sale, and that's just my opinion. But uh, this is the case itself. Uh, I have this location there. I'll leave the link in the description. They have all kind of little superheroes and things like that. So I'll just crack them open real quick. And, you know, I'm pretty sure you've seen everybody named Mama. With these on i'll just do it so you guys can see you know uh, i just don't like the fit <laughs> i guess it's just you know uh whatever uh ear type is and that's just with it whatever you go with some people love them some people don't love them my opinion either get the uh, buds plus or save your money for the airpods pro that would be my opinion but again I'm just a guy on YouTube. <laughs> so, well, <clears throat> I'll get you guys up out of here. You guys take care of each other. Peace.